Alright, let us begin. We're a deep space shipping company. Ooh! It's only an employee of any merit, Captain Olimar. Um, crashed it, got hit by an meteor, a, me a meteor, meteor, uh, went to a planet, crashed into a planet, I'm pretty sure that's, uh, Africa, but still escaped, got out of there, and unfortunately hooked up the free, um, got into some major credit card debt. Captain Olomar. Olomar. Planet Hokate. Hokate Freight. President of the Hokate Freight and local employee, Nui. A ravenous space bunny. <laughs> and that includes your ship. Ten thousand one hundred speckles. <laughs> He's still excited. One more. What is that? <laughs> treasure, treasure, treasure. Money, 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 money. Olimar, get the hell out of here. Go pay off my debt. There he goes. <laughs> Pikmin games have so much charm. But yeah, uh, as you can tell, this ship is not exactly built for uh, sturdiness. But that's also Olimar's uh, Final Smash rocket right there. Valley of Repose. Oh, we lost Louis.
Louis. It's a Duracell battery! I think in the GameCube version it actually is a Duracell battery. Okay, cool, it does find one. Oh, then watch Louis' face. <laughs> he gets little stress marks when he sees something. <laughs> He's like, no, get, me, get him the hell out of here. That's your son. You're a dad. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have to go through this whole tutorial. Yours, it's Bella's. She's gonna bite you. All right, you learned the hard way. <laughs> now I'm gonna save for that final character. <laughs> I didn't do the Easter egg in the last game. I'll have to show you. Oh, actually, no, it's in this. Yeah, it's this game. 
I'll show you guys it in this game. But it's once we get 20 of each Pikmin. Back together. A small price to pay for salvation, true. There's no difference between the captains. It's not like, oh, Louis like strong or anything. No, it's just, it's purely like just decorative. It's going good, Scolio. It's going good. We actually just finished uh, Pikmin 1 a few minutes ago. And now we are doing Pikmin 2. And that's the nice thing. Louie will actually help you. He's not useless. You know, he, he is kind of stupid. I'm pretty sure, hang, hang on, I'm gonna check something. I'm positive that in the original game, when you grab that item, it's not, it, it's a Duracell battery. I'm legit, like, serious. It is! <laughs> it is! In Pikmin 2, it's a dorsal battery! <laughs> Thanos quotes are... <laughs> All that for a drop of blood. <laughs> I'm not kidding. But they must have changed it. So this is the updated version. This must be the PAL version. $280. The Courage Reactor. My current thinking. <laughs> yes, the, well, Thanos is one of my favorite villains. That's why it sucks, because, like, literally all my favorite Marvel villains have been in the movies now. Carnage, Thanos, Dormammu. 
Louis doesn't even fit inside. His helmet is sticking out of it. That's why Infinity War is so cool because it's not really an Avengers movie. It's Thanos' movie. We've got 280 Pocos. Then we got 20 Red Pikmin. We got mail. All right. Let's head back to the Valley of Repose. Yeah. Oh, cool. What do you have to say for yourself? What lazy creatures. <laughs> True. The Empire Strike Backs is another one. Uh, Harry Potter Deathly Hollows Part 1, technically. Billy, stop slacking off. Oh yeah, half blood prints. Yep, that's another one. Of the ring way before any of these. I still need to go back and rewatch all the Lord of the Rings series. these guys to get started on this. There's an item we'll get later that makes this part so much easier. Where all you gotta do is press the B button and it, it rolls them all out of the ground for you.
I already know this. All right, let's go killing. You stay here. Let's go, Louie. Put your back into it. Hurry up. Oh, hey, there's a plant up here. Here. Come here. Forward march. All right, let's see what we can find over here. But this is. So this is the main gimmick of Pikmin 2, is these little dungeons. Uh, but we're not going to go into that one just yet. We need to take this piece of... We need to go take this Coca-Cola can over to the spaceship. And then we'll go and join... And then we'll go over there. But I hope you guys have been having a good day, chat. Or I hope you had a good day. I... KI was okay today. No, wait, no, okay, that was good today. Street Fighter 6 went terrible today. <laughs> it was rough. And then, uh, Smash Ultimate went okay, and then it got better over time. Alright, one of those red Pikmin's off. You're off! He's off rhythm. You're throwing off the groove. Get back in formation. The utter scrap. All right, let's head over to that little cave, and we're gonna start exploring. We're going into the first dungeon. Alonzi. Dive on in! The Emergence Cave. Stick the landing. All right. 
We've got a lot of So, we got some treasure and we got some dead bodies. Now you're probably wondering, can you grow Pikmin down here? And the answer is no, you cannot. Spicy ginger ale, <laughs> the quenching emblem. So then what, what do they do with the bodies? Well, um, this. These are not worth much. <laughs> Big orange. Oh, wait, it's just a regular orange. Yes. <laughs> no, wait, that's just a regular orange. <laughs> and it's worth 180 pokos. The citrus lump. It's ex this is an expired orange. Look how flimsy that shit is. If you hear that noise, that means that you've, you've gotten all treasures in, in this cave. So there are no more treasures here. We can move on to the next floor. And we're gonna go deeper, baby. I think this first one's like three floors, three or five floors. No, it actually we're at the end. The final floor. <gasps> we already get them? Hell yes. You see that big ass thing? You need a hundred and one Pikmin. So how is it going to be possible? How are we going to lift up something that, you know, we can't even have a hundred red Pikmin? Well, we just saw it in the distance and we, and I, it's a little teaser. So, say hello to the most broken Pikmin that have ever existed. Meet the purple Pikmin. <laughs> They're sumo wrestlers. purple Pikmin the most broken Pikmin and I'll show you why there there's a great thing to show purple Pikmin are one unfortunately slower than regular Pikmin they they just move slower so that's unfortunate however purple Pikmin if we go to that globe 
Honda Pikmin, yes. Are they broken like in Smash? Worse. One purple Pikmin counts as ten Pikmin. That's how strong they are. Just wait till we uh we find some enemies though. That's where things get a little interesting. Pocos for the Spherical Atlas. Oh yeah, and Brawl, he, he's really broken. And that's all the treasure too. But we're all done here. He was top three because he was slight. He was his. He was a good zoning character as well as being uh, uh, really hard to kill because of his recovery. His recovery was busted. All right, let's head back to the surface. That's why they kind of nerfed him in ult in four and ultimate. They actually lowered how many Pikmin he can have. Whee! <laughs> nice. And no Pikmin died. The cave is complete. We got three of three treasures, so that cave is done. We will never have to come back here. Five. Here we get five. That's right, in this game there is no time limit. You have no time limit to uh, get treasures, so you don't have to worry about rushing through it. Take your time. Also, you're probably wondering where Purple Pikmin go. Yeah, they go in the ship. <laughs> they just kind of just like hop in there. They seem to like it. <laughs> Yeah, purple pigment don't have an onion, so they don't go in the red one or the blue one or the yellow one. They have to go in there. Baby steps first, Olimar. Our debt is with happy Hokutai savings and loans. After all, besides, there's nothing left to repossess, so ha! The president's going to be one of the, the funniest characters in this game. To the next area! The Awakening Wood. That sounds terrible. That is not appropriate. <laughs> hey, there's Blue Pikmin.
All right, remember how I said red or purple Pikmin are broken? You're about to find out why. So this is how you pull purple Pikmin out. There's sometimes an enemy that looks like one of those plants. Alright, so you remember how I said purple pigment are broken? Let me explain why. Part 2. Purple pigment have a, a slam effect. When they get thrown, they dunk. Now normally, if you just stomp on one bulb, on one bulb board like that, they just die. So that's normal. However... If you really want to go nuts, let's gather all the Pikmin, and we're going to just throw the purple ones first. Never existed. Here, do me a favor. Take that. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Actually, the funny thing is, uh, purple pigment do get nerfed. They get nerfed in the next game. Oh, hey. Purple Pikmin now is a flower Pikmin. You want you want Pikmin to grow to get all their power ups as soon as possible. that stuff off. These ones will get to work over here. Oh, hey! Cool! These are important. We need these. And it's a strawberry! The name? The Sunseed Berry. Eh, close enough. Oh, we hit the max. That's why. Only 100 Pikmin can be out at the same time. 10% of debt recovered. A. Oh, you can get doing that. need this. This is not a treasure, but 
Ultra Spice. While they work, I'll leave Louie here. Ultra spicy spray. Ten berries will give you one, but there's a little glitch you can do to just get more. First one we're gonna see. Go faster, men, faster, faster, faster. Get a chance. <laughs> Get to work. We need a uh, yellow pigment for that. That's an enemy. I saw that eye blink. I saw that shit. Bastard. Oh, we need way more. Got a treasure. We got a cave. Go get some more red or purple Pikmin. We need flame resistant Pikmin. Some caves you have to like, you have to need specific kinds, so it kind of gives you a warning ahead of time. We can't even touch that gate because we need poison. We need white Pikmin, and we don't have enough purple Pikmin to knock that over.
All right, let's head to the next area. The next uh, dungeon. Missing one, where'd he go? There you are. Come on, yeah. Come on. Come on. E Honda, hurry up. Dive on in. Hole of Beasts. Good to work. Nothing. These are pennies, but I mean, might as well take them. It's a D-pad! <laughs> The Stone of Glory. That's all the treasures on this floor. Next floor. The sub level two. Hey, on chat, I'm gonna take my dogs outside real quick. You guys need to go outside? to play stuff Daisy it's, it's late all right we are back let's go unfortunately red purple pigment are limited um, you only get uh, you only get so many 
and you have to sacrifice some of your other Pikmin to get them. So yeah, red potion. It's just a free shot. However, there's a glitch. Get double. <laughs> The sound effects are so weird. <laughs> yeah. How many treasures are here? Does it say? Sub level three. All right, here's where red Pikmin have a huge plus now in this game. Red Pikmin can actually now destroy fire geysers. So that's really helpful. Chat, look what it is. It's a floppy disk. Some of you might not even know what this is. Yeah, when your underground time is stopped, you can take your time and not worry about it as much. Um, and when you return to the surface, it's at the same exact time that you left. So yeah. <laughs> Strife monolith. Oh, you're, you are right. That is a Famicom. <laughs> I did not even realize that. Anything special in here? Nope. All right. The name? The Cosmic Archi Archive. All treasures... We got in all the treasures. Let's move on. So yeah, in this game, Red Pikmin aren't just your aggressors anymore. They are also pyro, uh, your firemen, basically. They can take care of fires for you, which is really helpful. <laughs> They're immune to fire, and they can take them out. They can take out fire geysers. Uh, purple Pikmin are your more aggressive ones now. Purple Pikmin make everything easier. Smell that chat? Blood. I, I see a victim. <laughs> As for super spicy, we will use it soon. Just not yet. We don't need it yet. And I don't want to waste it. 
I spy with my little eye a guy who's about to get murdered. After I go quick break this egg. Wherever it went. Where'd it go? There it is. I'm not gonna say anything in regards to that because y'all might get some other references here. <laughs> Now red pigment or purple pigment still have the same weaknesses as uh, uh, all the other pigmen. However, they are at least you know better at you know killing enemies. So we saw what ten of them could do. What about twenty? And look at the card. A Nintendo playing card. The lock the lock wafer. The dream architect. <laughs> That's all the treasures here too. Nice. Dive on in. We are okay, so ah, yes. Um, be very, very quiet. I'm hunting rabbits. So, we fought an Emperor Bull Blacks the last time. This is an Empress Bull Blacks. To the huge bitch, and but this is just a baby version. This is a very easy fight. There's a much harder version. God damn it! They ran underneath her. Hang on. Oh yeah, uh, so that's a fun glitch. You see them dancing over there during cutscenes. But god damn it, we don't want to lose purple pigment and freaking four of them decided, hey, let's go run and beat up her fat instead. 
bosses don't even count for that much money. 15 coins. That's it. But yeah, that was the end of that. Sadly, we lost some Pikmin, and I don't think we can revert to a previous save. Yeah, give up and escape. Yeah, no. That's unfortunate. We lost some purple Pikmin. We never want to lose purple Pikmin. They're too valuable. Love tester. The prototype detector. And now we have a treasure gauge. So now, you know, we can detect where treasure's at. And if you see it grayed out, that means you found all treasures.